I thought I would make a separate video for identities. So identities are very similar to equations. However, equations are only true for certain or specific values of x. Identities, signified by triple equals sign, no matter what value you input into this, it will always be true. So, by definition, it's a form of equation, but it is true for all values of the input variable. So the input variable in this case would be x, as you can see. But if you think about it, let's say x was 2. So 2 multiplied by 2 is 4, 3 multiplied by 2 is 6, and 5 multiplied by 2 is 10. So 4 plus 6 will always equal 10. And this will be the case with all of them, because if you take a number, multiply it by 2, and add 3 lots of that number, it's always going to make 5 lots of that number. So looking on to some harder examples now, we have some more algebraic ones, which you might already know without knowing, but when you expand a bracket, it will always give you this form. This one is something called completing the square. Again, you may not have heard of that yet, but you will definitely learn that at some point in your GCSEs. And I will make a video on it in the near future. And then you also get trigonometric identities. So trigonometry identities based on that. And this is an interesting one. If you take any value, put it into your calculator in this form, it will always give you one when you add it. But thank you for watching and I hope that helped.